what is going on everybody welcome back to the show make sure to like comment share subscribe follow that instagram and twitter and blah blah anyway today what we're going to be talking about is star wars why because i'm a fan of star wars okay we're going to be talking about um the new star wars game and you know it's very brief thus far the reason being is because the trailer just came out today and it hasn't even come out like it literally just the trailer came out and then a brief description of what it is so i wrote it down because i don't have photographic memory um this is set after the battle of endor and the destruction of the second death star it takes you um through two different pilots those are the stories two different pilots um uh that are set for the new republic's vanguard squadron and the emperor's titan uh squadrons respectively so you're gonna you could play for either one okay you could play either side and um it's called star wars squadron and it's on the ps4 xbox one and it should be released by october but this is the biggest thing of all vr you heard me, ladies and gentlemen. VR. This game is going to come out on the PlayStation in VR. I can't even tell you. First of all, it's about damn time they're releasing Star Wars games that are this good. It's about time. I always, every time I watch Star Wars movies, the first thought in my head is, oh my god, the video game department in Star Wars is lacking so much. Look at the graphics. Look at the storylines. You can make a game... You can make some of the most top-tier games for Star Wars. I don't understand why they haven't tapped into that market yet. But this game looks like it is probably the most revolutionary game that Star Wars has ever created in their entire lives. Now, I think now is the perfect time to start this. And with the VR, dude, I don't. it just gives it sends chills down my spine to know that you can literally live in the Star Wars world through VR. This is really the future. I mean, seriously, this is really the future. You could literally just put the VR headset on and go outside and carry like some sort of like fake weapon and pretend like you are in the actual world of Star Wars. Imagine how the 50 year olds that were watching Star Wars back then feel today. Like, Take your 60-year-old grandpa or something like that and give him that VR set. And if he's a huge Star Wars fan and be like, look at this. He's going to – he just would never think in his wildest dreams that this was not a reality. Now, think about it with people today. People today are stunned with what's going on. Imagine like the older, older generation that literally used to watch Star Wars and they used to see like the stupidest graphics and think, wow, look how amazing. Now they can live in it. This is so cool, honestly. I can't wait for the game to come out. I'm going to buy the game. I'm going to buy the VR set. I don't care if it costs me $1,000. I want to literally live in the Star Wars world. Imagine how crazy that'll be. I just, I can't wrap my head around that. Man, I, I'm so hype for this. I'm honestly so hype to see where this is going to go. Because I feel like they could do this with Harry Potter. They could do this with Star Wars. They could do this with uh, Fast and Furious. Dude, all like these major series of games, they could do this with Avatar, um, World of Warcraft, Th these huge series, they could do so much with them. And I feel like they haven't even, we haven't even gotten to like the tip of the iceberg for what we could do. We haven't even gotten to the beginning for what we could do. We haven't tapped into anything yet in the video game world, and this just proves it. Imagine every single... So what happens is usually a domino effect. That's how technology works. You have one company usually revolutionize something, and then everybody else just starts doing it because, you know, it's just opening a new market. Easy econ. This is one of those things. Star Wars is one of the first people to ever actually do this. I feel like VR was more of just like test games and sword games and knife games and like cooking games but there hasn't actually been a real commercialized game like imagine playing mario imagine playing super mario sunshine through a vr headset this is going to tap in this is going to open a huge market that's it this is it mario is going to be on there world of warcraft is going to be on there the vr headsets are going to be ridiculous Anyway, tell me what you guys think. I'm super hyped for this game. I'm going to buy it. Make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you all next time. Peace out.